Hi guys and welcome. If you want to build your own landing page or website really fast, easy and without an extra effort, this video can be handy for you because in this video I'm going to show you all the things that you need to know. I'm going to provide you with an all information that you need to build your own landing page or website using this fantastic tool and great platform. And I want to show you this platform and I want to show you all the editing features. And in the end of this video, you're going to get an idea of how to build it by yourself really fast. And you don't need to spend some money on uh, to hire some professionals to build uh, your landing page or website. Definitely, it, it can be difficult uh, if you know nothing, but this is the purpose of this video. I'm going to show you everything and you're going to know everything. Uh, before I start, I want to say that I don't want to make this video like one hour long. I saw all those tutorials in YouTube, uh, like one hour long, two hour long, and some of uh, guys like selling courses to have how to build landing page. This video is going to be short and with a maximum value. And I believe that uh, it's better to spend time to physically building your uh, page than to watch YouTube videos. So um, I want to say that our team left the link in the description panel of this video and you can easily get access to this platform. And this is most convenient way. So check the link in the description, jump in and let's start doing business. You need to start a free trial. Free trial is for 14 days. You need to choose a plan and you can switch that plan off uh, in any time that you want. So it's pretty enough. Uh, 14 days is pretty enough to build everything up. And I'm sure that you can handle that uh, like under one hour. So let me show you everything and let's jump in. This is the dashboard of the platform sites, landing pages and sites. As we're talking about the landing pages, let's press create new landing page and you'll see that you have a lot of templates already pre-built for any of your business purposes that you may have uh, ever. Like page type, you can sort it to find the correct template. You can sort it by industry, by page type, by style, by, by color and so on. And when you're going to find the template that catches your eye, it's going to be great to use that template to customize it a little bit. And uh, like, here you go, you have a ready site that you can launch. First, you need to give your page a name and you can change it later. Uh, I'm going to show you where you can change it because this is going to be the URL uh, and this is the page name actually. And here it uh, here it is. Uh, there's lead matter, excellent, uh, ex it shows excellent and it, this is excellent uh, widget that shows how your landing page will convert your visitors to your customers. And this is totally insane because this is really helpful. Uh, let's hover over the surface and you see that you have some elements here. Uh, and on each element, you have this pencil button. So that's how you can edit each element that you see on the surface, uh, except this container boxes. And I'm going to show you where to find it. Uh, you see the white, white color. Also, uh, you have the spacers here. And this is the logo. You have a spacers here and you have this divider. So when you uh, see that, that blue vertical line you can grab it and move it to get the shape and you see all the elements reshaping by itself so you can get the shape that you want even that one like you have enough things to play around with uh, on, on this uh, on this part so that's pretty great I'm gonna show you where to find this for example I want to change the color of this background of this uh, white box so you go into layout you see that you have two sections hero and footer this is the hero section so we press it on it and we can change section style that's uh, what that will happen in a couple seconds you see the header main content and when we press in the main content we see that there's a spacer and there's opt-in area and this opt-in area we press in this gear button and we see that there's a color and that's pretty it and you can change this color to any of those that you want, but it's better to leave it like that. I'm just showing you where to find that. Alrighty, header section style. Uh, we have an image here. We can change this image straight from this spot. You can use uh, images that you used for previous projects. 
uh, or you can buy images straight from from Shutterstock, and it's uh, about eight bucks per picture. So if if you want, you can buy them, or you can upload your own media. I'm gonna use this uh, fantastic girl, and uh, want to show you like little life hack image color overlay. Let's add a color. I want to use some gray color and you see the picture is covered and you change the opacity and the girl is still there and the block is more visible is more readable I want to move it up that's pretty it that's cool you see the size of this uh, block is not so big so let's go to edit section settings and you see the minimum height this can be made automatically 50, 75, 90, or full. So automatically is uh, always good, and you can leave it like that. But well, you have a lot of things to play around. Uh, but let's jump forward. Layout. We see that in our layout we have just hero and footer, and we need maybe we need to add some uh, information. We need to show some video or pictures, or, or we have. Uh, more beautiful girls out there so let's add a section and there are sections that are pre-built for uh, most use cases like call to action contact us FAQs features and services hero logos uh, pricing and testimonials and so on and black so you can build like a really nice layout straight on one page and that's gonna be great now uh, you can use blank sections if you want if you didn't find the correct one and you can drag and drop them to the spot where you can see uh like drop here all right all right that's great let's go to layout hero footer not on the spot about we're gonna delete this about section we can make it from here or we can make it from here the same thing delete uh, now we have the footer not on the spot so you see this hand little shaky hand Just grabbing it and you put in this to the to the basement okay what do we have here we have the transparent uh, it's transparent and I'm gonna show you why uh, like drag and drop widgets to get started I want to show the video of this yoga class maybe and I want the button to be here to like sign up or I want the coupon code yeah there are a lot of widgets but if you're gonna press show less you'll see that those eight actually is pretty enough to build everything up text image and text image video button form line and space and that's it I want maybe one image second image here uh, and uh, I want a text to be here yeah what's happening with the text just double click on it grab it all headline area in the center and let it be white we're gonna change some color right now button you see that everything that can that connected with the style can be uh, made here small medium big or full width uh, square and let it be like this color and tax is gonna be black and I want spacer to be here I want spacer to be here cool guys isn't that cool it's so so fast it's so easy uh, and let's go to styles I want to show you the page background so the uh, you can change font styles for all the headlines that you have in your layout and for all the text straight from here straight from this spot uh, and you don't need to change each piece of the text if you have long layout uh, also page background let's play around with that so we have maybe this girls and you see this parallax effect this fantastic parallax effect that you can get uh, applying the picture to the background just to show you but I'm gonna use a color and maybe it's gonna be this one or maybe it's gonna be simple gray you see uh, everything is like in one style uh, all the buttons are pretty the same 
Uh, I'm gonna delete this section out because I don't want this section to be here. Uh, I'm gonna change the color of the background of the footer to black. And here you go. Here we have like completed work. Uh, inactive button you see and that's very important and that what I wanted to show you from the beginning but uh, it's time inactive button here you have some active button because it's not uh, showing you edit click event and the same thing add click event so no link option open a pop-up in most cases and that's what I'm gonna show you open a calendar pop-up jump to page section link the landing page link the external URL so enough options to uh to get your buttons be efficient like open a pop-up you can create new pop-up you can select the pop-up edit the click event uh you can select the pop-up that you had in the template and let's edit this pop-up uh, all the fonts all the colors all the things you can change here i showed you that uh but the most important part is edit integrations what are those? How are you going to get lead notification? It's going to jump to your email or you can switch on external services like one of those from the list. And this is a really impressive list. Convocate, get response, mail, cheap, active campaign, Aweber. All those are uh, online marketing tools. In general, it's uh, the tools for uh, email marketing and they have built in CRM. And if your leads will drop to MailChimp, for example, you can work with that information, you can work with that audience, you can grow your email list, and you can make more money on that list, because money is on the list, you need to warm up your audience, you need to sell them more, and so on and so on. If you don't want to buy one of those uh, tools, you can integrate everything for free with a Zapier and Google Sheets, for example, uh, or uh, Zoom, for example, or Trello, if you have them, some Trello. This is also a cool tool, like Zapier can connect everything for free uh, and you'll be happy. Fields, uh, what, info, what kind of information do you want? Like email and let's add a field like first name. Do not use more than two fields because uh, in general people are lazy and uh, as for me, I don't want to complete this form that has like 10 fields. Yeah, just name, email, that's okay, that's enough. And what's gonna be? Like, we promised to receive the coupon code, yeah? Some lead magnet, so we can add this lead magnet straight here, uh, and uh, it's gonna be sent to our customer who completed the form. That's pretty it. Or options, default lead pages, thank you page, or you can build your own external landing page uh, to say thank you with all your brand colors, with all your logo, or maybe you want to make an upsell or a cross-sell if you're selling something uh, externally or out, it can be also uh, to, to flow the human being uh, up to your like sales funnel and so on. There are a lot of options. Let's save and close. Just make sure that all your buttons uh, are working properly before you go live with your website. Uh, let's go. I showed you everything, like layout, sections, widgets, styles, and let's go to settings a little bit. SEO, definitely you need to be visible to search engines. Uh, if not, you need to switch on the flag if you want to be visible. So page description, page keywords uh, need to be made, need to be done. Social, uh, if you want to share a link to your landing page or website to some Facebook or uh, Pinterest or some else social media, choose an image here uh, and be much more happier because that how it will be displayed in the social media analytics if you want to run your business for serious and you want to uh you want to make correct decisions definitely you need to get analytical information and google analytics tracking id is always a great idea language you can choose from the list that's it guys that's it i promised you to make this video as short as possible this is a short video and I hope that in the end of this video, you finally get an idea that everything is simple, everything is easy, and you can build everything up like under one hour. If you have a content, if you have pictures, and if even if you don't have a pictures, you can buy them straight here. Uh, you can type all the text and you can play around with all the settings. Just 
you need to do that, you know? So go to the description panel of this video, find the link, get access to this platform and start building your own landing page and you'll handle that for sure. Thanks for watching this video till the end, hope you enjoyed and hope this was really useful and hope you will use this information. See you in the next video. Cheers, take care, bye bye.